Hey guys, ST here. So, um, what you're about to see is one of my typical shows of gluttony. Um, I'm recording a before and an after segment because the in-between segment is going to be time-lapsed. So, you won't actually be able to hear me talking about anything during it. Um, basically, according to the subject line on the video, I've got, I can't even get it out of the bag. Um, Arby's has an item on their website called the Meat Mountain, which is basically every meat that they have in the store on a sandwich. It's got, you know, the brisket, the corned beef, the roast beef, the turkey, the ham, the bacon, the chicken tenders. The only thing that's miss missing is the fish, which is probably good because that would just be gross. Um, and then it's got uh, some cheese. No sauces. I didn't think to get any sauce when I grabbed the Meat Mountain from my local Arby's. If you go in to order it, <clears throat> chances are good that you're not going to see any signage for it. But if you go to the register, they'll probably have it and they can just ring it up on the register. It is about 10 bucks, but with all that meat, I'm not surprised. Um, anyway, like I said, this is going to be the before video. I have not yet started consuming it. And then uh, you guys get to watch me consume it in a different location. And then I'll do an after video telling you how it was and how I'm feeling, which, you know, might be sick. But anyway, uh, see you in a few. If you just got done watching, is that recording? Yeah, that's recording. Just got done watching, you saw me consume mostly the entire sandwich, the Meat Mountain. Um, there were a couple parts of like really fatty portions that I just, I could not do. I, that the texture, I just, I can't do that. It gets my mouth and bleh. I almost lost it when I got the first bit. <clears throat> After that point, I just kind of tried to avoid them. But I did show you guys the few little strips of meat. I've got the uh, meat hiccups now. The few little strips of meat that uh, were left on the paper when I got done. Overall, <clears throat> here's my impression. Definitely should have brought some sauce. I should have gotten either some horsies or just some general Arby's or something like that. Uh, it's very tasty. If you enjoy the Arby's meats, you will definitely enjoy the sandwich. Everything 
it wasn't really warmed all the way through, but I don't think like a lot of their sandwiches come hot anyway. Like the turkey sandwiches don't necessarily come hot, so I wasn't too surprised. Uh, everything was layered well. Uh, there was a slice of cheddar at the top and a slice of Swiss somewhere in the middle. Bacon, I, I don't even know. Check back in the video for the... Uh, it wasn't too terribly noxious. It, it, strictly because of all the meat, it was definitely a $10 sandwich. However, it's, it was about the equivalent in volume as eating a footlog from some ways. So, you know, not, not too terrible, not too shabby. Uh, I enjoyed it. I probably will not buy it again just because it's 10 bucks, and I can get a whole bunch of other stuff for 10 bucks. But, um, <clears throat> hey, if you, if you want to give it a go, go for it. Let me know. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, and uh, tell me other things you want to see me eat so that you don't have to. Until next time, SD out. I'm going to go take a nap now. Bye.